My name is Sita Beckwith, I'm the Communications Manager here at Ceres Environment Park. My name's uh, Shane French and I'm the Manager for the Incursions and Excursions part of the Education team at Ceres Community Environment Park. We're a non-profit organisation, we're based in Brunswick East. We have four and a half hectares of land. We're now a registered organic farm. We deliver environmental education programs to school students around the state. Uh, we do an organic fruit and veg box delivery scheme and run a bunch of different social enterprises. The Ceres uh, Organic Farm has been a core part of what Ceres does um, and has been since the start of the park. There's a lot of evidence that organic is better for you. It's certainly better for the environment. And it's also a way of farming with the seasons and farming with the climatic patterns that you have in an area. We deliver fruit and veg boxes to around 900 households across Melbourne per week. It's grown to the stage where it's actually a third of the turnover of our entire business and we're rapidly becoming one of the largest um, organic fruit and veg buyers in Victoria. So we're finding that schools are wanting to embed sustainability and environmental education across their curriculum. When Ceres first started, the idea of having a garden at your school and coming to Ceres to learn how to have gardens in your school was quite revolutionary. But now it's standard, you know, it's, it's just part of what we do. When I first started here in 2010, we received in that year our one millionth school visitor. Uh, our main thing that we do is try and educate young minds about environmental and social changes that they can make in their own lives, that they can take back home to their families and that they can make a difference. You know, if we all come together, we can improve our practices and change the world.